And strong winds today led to problems all across the area. KSNT News reporter Dan Garrett joins us live from southwest Shawnee County near Dover, where for days now, crews have been fighting the Crawford wildfire that keeps rekindling. So, Dan, what are you seeing right now from your vantage point? Yeah, but crews are out here right now surrounding a home, making sure that none of these flames get to this home that people are living in here in Dover. Now over to this side of the screen, there is a fire that you can see. Now this was intentionally set by the firefighters, firefighters here. They are back burning the wood around the house. So when the fire does reach this point, all of that wood will already be burned. So hopefully it will not get any closer to this home. Now the firefighters thought they had this fire put out earlier today around noon. And then just an hour later, they were called back out here because the wind started this fire up again. And now they will be out here all night monitoring these conditions because the winds are so strong tonight. There's such a high possibility that these fires could be kicked back up. And I did speak to the fire chief on the scene here, and he says right now they are just praying that there will be rain tomorrow to help them with this fight against this brush fire. Covering local news that matters, I've in Dover, Dan Garrett, KSNT News.